Hi, I'm Don Monique Williams, Aurora Theater's Associate Artistic Director, and I will be directing Dominique Morso's Paradise Blue for the 22-23 season. Paradise Blue is set in Dominique's hometown of Detroit, Michigan. The year is 1949. We are at the Paradise Club on the strip known as Paradise Valley in the neighborhood known as Black Bottom. The residents there are facing new tensions as the mayor is on the move to rid the city of urban blight. And so urban renewal and contractors and development is encroaching. And Blue, a haunted trumpeteer, is faced with a choice. Does he sell the club or does he keep the club? And if he sells the club, what happens to the house band that plays bebop? And what happens to his devoted wife, Pumpkin? There's so many rich textures to this play. There's the bebop music. There's the haunted spirits in all of these characters. There's a mysterious woman, Silver, who arrives at the club and disrupts everyone's life, teaching Pumpkin some valuable lessons along the way. There's Corn and P. Sam, members of blues bands who are also trying to navigate their own music careers and their life and love and what it would mean to be without this regular gig. More so has written Paradise Blue as part of the Detroit Project, a trilogy of three plays set across different times in her home to explore the evolution, the change, the growth of Detroit. I love that Morisot writes about home. It's something that's become increasingly important to me as we've navigated the last few years of this pandemic. I've become really enthralled with migration stories. How do we end up points north and west? How do we leave our homes in the south? I appreciate so much that Morisot is investigating all of this and her own family roots and heritage in Detroit. I'm happy to dive into this play with some wonderful collaborators who I've worked with before, some at Aurora and some not. Joining me on this adventure will be scenic designer Stephen Jones, lighting designer Stephanie Ann Johnson, sound designer Cliff Crothers. It's a huge point of pride for me that Aurora would produce this play. As you know, if you've been a longtime Aurora subscriber, um, we did Detroit 67 not too long ago to great acclaim. I hope you'll join us as we bring this other story from Dominique Morso to our stages.